with Jericho and Christian get your shit ready. What is what's going on here? Frustration maybe? Losing a big important match at Devil's Fugue, I'd be super pissed myself too. This is our continuation, ladies and gentlemen. And if if, it's, if, the, if the tournament bracket is right, Lethal Enforcers are gonna meet the winning team of the uh, uh, the winning team of this match next Sunday night, March the third. Two weeks before we're supposed to have our finals, and the content and the contingency might will probably continue on on Tuesday night, bumming the contingency and the show itself. But what a night it has been so far! Two great victories, and especially Scott Pilgrim. I still can't get over it. Randy Orton is so pissed. He has not had a great 2013. Hell, his only major highlight is removing Shawn Michaels from the No Mercy brand. Which I think was a stupid move. I can't believe Shawn Michaels just gave up like that and allowing Randy Orton to win. I mean, Shawn, didn't you want to stay here? We even gave you a contract. I mean, you put it on the line, dude. That's kind of that's a huge mistake. Now, Randy Orton is, is here with us, and so far he's being a punching bag, and that's just that's just strange. I don't want to see Randy Orton try to destroy FPW. I don't want him to try to destroy the One Mercy brand. I got a feeling he just might do that. He was much better off. Oh, beautiful leg drop by Junior. He was much better off with Chris Masters as the lethal, as the legendary masterpiece. Excuse me. They were contenders. They were going for the gold. Because of Chris Masters, Randy Orton got much more popular. Double teamage. How about that? Great teamwork there by Christian and Jericho. And look at this, Anaconda Vice. Great wrestling move. That was broken up there by Y2J. Speaking of Chris Masters, folks, the injury update, as far as we know, Chris Masters and John Heidenreich should be back soon. And I mean very soon. Look at this! The Unprettier! I can't believe it! Lands the Unprettier, put over the cover, and Junior escapes. While Paul London was gonna make some attempt, some move to break up that pinning predicament. Rolling Cradle! Tissue and elbow drop! Aw oh, man! Look at that! That was a, that was beautiful. A beautiful move from Christian that bought him plenty of time and momentum to actually land that head scissors takedown, executing it like beautiful. I just can't believe it. And a sweet escape by Junior. Oh, poking the eyes, flying head scissors, this is an all-out chaotic battle where the winner faces Lethal Enforcers in their continuation of the Tag Team Tournament. Or should I say the T4 Tornado Tag Team Tournament. Off the ropes, big low, low drop, leg drop, courtesy of Hulk Hogan. Mm. Look at that, great combination there by Christian, an inverted atomic drop followed by a head scissors take doom. Look at London with a jawbreaker. This is real wrestling we're seeing tonight, folks, and I am glad we're seeing it. Look at that, snapping off a beautiful arm drag. 
And Doug Jr. with the steamroller. Oh, look at that. That was cool. We saw that. That lion saw hit the referee. Same move that Scott Pilgrim did. Look how arrogant Jericho is. Look at that. No need to make a dramatic kick out from, from that situation. That's just ridiculous. Now on the full mount is London carving those knuckle sandwiches with the forehead of Captain Charisma. Oh, going for a head scissors, but a calamity of carnage in the ring. Test of strength, who's gonna get it? London looks like he's furious. Boot to the guts. Don't turn your back on Christian there, London. Get back to work. Snapmare, nicely done. Tonight, folks, still to come. Champion versus champion. Kid Trustworthy, the reigning No Mercy champion, takes on the WWE champion, The Rock. He is definitely in the building, definitely in the gym, training. We cannot believe that the WWE face right now, The Rock, Dwayne Johnson, star of Snitch, G.I. Joe, and many, many, many other films, is in the building tonight to main event Oscar night here at No Mercy Hardcore Wrestling. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Cross face on Jericho. And look how fast Christian broke up that submission hold. Look how fast he was to be there for his own partner. And here is the unprettier square on his face, going for the cover, but look at how fast London is. Oh no. Jericho's got the legs of London to the walls of Jericho here. Bad situation, look at the back. Oh my goodness, look at that beautiful execution. I don't care if he got his own partner. That was a nice transition over wrestling moves. And the audience, the FW Wrestling World, were chanting for Paul London. Oh, look at that rock bottom. How about that? Taking a page out of the rock's book. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna agree with you on that universe or the wrestling world. I should say. Oh, look at Junior. Look at a man of prey. Look at this steamroller on Y2J. And look at Junior fighting back now. Wow. The cover on Y2J and Jericho kicks out no problem. Junior is so brave. Jericho now. Oh, wait a sec. Look at this. London now on the rescue. Saving Junior from the potential walls of Jericho. Suplex coming up. No. Countered. But Jericho grabs him. And Jericho. I don't know what to do exactly. Look at Junior, a house on fire, and look at that. To ignite the flame, Jericho comes out with a face jam. Make that two face jams. It hasn't had enough, but so did London. Oh my goodness. These guys are awesome. One, two, two, and a kick out. Another walls of Jericho. Oh, look at that slow-mo effect. That is called drama. Wait a second. Oh, no, you're kidding me. At the same time, the walls of Jericho was executed. Back away, Sky. Just let him have it, Sky. Let him have it. 
unbelievable, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely unbelievable and unprecedented victory. Why wow, they definitely deserve that score, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that. Double S is everywhere. And 592% is the final mark. That fan loves London. That sign you're seeing is inverted for we love London. I've never been there before, folks, but <laughs> needless to say, what a spectacular wrestling performance from Y2J, Chris Jericho and Christian. They've advanced on to the second round, I suppose, in the tournament against Lethal Enforcers, that legendary tag team of Pantalix and McDoom. We'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen, with a quick intermission. Pick up whatever you want in the inventory section. Some snacks, uh, you know, a smoke break, a tote break, whatever you want, folks. And we'll meet you back in 15 minutes. <laughs>